So it's been a little while since I've done a video, so I've taken the headlights out, the front bumper off, the hood off, I've sanded a little bit, I'm a little freaked out about sanding, so I didn't do too much. There's several layers to go through, this is the original cover color, the silver. Um, I took the T-tops off, I did them. There's so many curves on this car that I was afraid of sanding. There are the T-tops. There's the valance. I ordered a new valance. This is the broken piece here and a new spoiler. Um, the spoiler was in stock, so they sent that, but the valance won't come here for a long time. I took, there's, I sanded the headlight um, assemblies. To a slight degree, I took off the back bumper. I cleaned out the stuff back there. There was a lot of sand. <laughs> um, I found this little thing in my hood. It uh, opens and closes uh, to let air into the cowl. Um, it was not plugged in. It does work. I tested the motor. It works fine. I'm going to sandblast that. I'm going to sandblast the locking mechanism for the hood. And all these screws and stuff. Sandblast all those. There's the hood over there. I washed it. I'm getting it all cleaned up. I'm going to paint it. Um, this inner kind of trapezoidal area gets a heat shielding, sound dampening foam on it and then there's a piece of foam in the engine compartment that runs across here so I saw in a video that somebody put foam all the way to the nose it looked super cool but it won't clear the foam that's already there on the radiator so they had to cut it and get rid of this piece after all um, there are 11 of these thingies that hold that in place and uh, I you push your thing over it, and then you clip on a clip that clips clips it in place. So, um, this is where the wire for that thing that opens goes, and then it sits in here, and it has a little flap that opens and closes. Um, I think as you demand more air, then it should suck air through here into your air cleaner, but what, what they had was they had something that would uh, seal on this circle and then that air could get sucked in, but this no longer has that. Um, it just has the regular air cleaner, so I'm not too worried about whether it works or not, but I am going to put back together clean it up, paint it, put it back together, and uh, plug it in. I found out that's what this plug here is for. Um, it plugs into that, so another mystery solved. Anyway, I'm going to pull my sandblasting cabinet out, put it up on the 2 by 4 no, the sawhorses, and start sandblasting. I got a bunch of bolts and screws inside the sandblast cabinet already, and then those items. I want to get them painted and put back together today.